Hello, I'm David Gauntler. I'm a Canada Research Chair in Communication and Design at Ryerson University. This is a very brief introduction to Creativity Everything, the lab which I've established there. For more than 12 or 13 years, I've worked with Lego, the company, on a range of different projects, which have been really fascinating to be involved in. Those have informed other work that I've done as well. I take from it one key idea. Lots of other ideas too, but one key one that has always stuck with me is to do with how do we design a creative experience? It should be a low floor, high ceiling, white walls experience. What does that mean? I will explain. The low floor means it's an experience that's really easy to step into. So you might see a bunch of Lego, you can pick it up and you can make something with it, even if you've never seen Lego before, very straightforward and easy to do. But high ceilings means you can take this to a very great level of complexity. So you can build a spaceship or an aeroplane with lots of details and complex parts. But wide walls means you don't need to be building spaceships or aeroplanes. You can build all kinds of things. You can do houses, flowers, animals, trees, furniture, whatever it is you want to build. And the combination of low floor, easy to step into, high ceiling for complexity, but wide walls for diversity, means you can have a really interesting platform for creativity. I use the phrase platforms for creativity to refer to any kind of environment, technology, tool, thing, toy, that invites people to step into a world of creativity that they otherwise would not have experienced. We want, of course, to be inclusive of all kinds of creativity and all kinds of people. So creativity that's not about one particular kind of technology or about one kind of tradition, but all the ways in which people might want to express themselves and all kinds of people. So including people who might not normally think of themselves as creative and people from a diverse set of backgrounds. You've probably heard about the rise of makers and the maker movement and maker spaces interesting and inspiring movements which often come with quite inclusive language about their invitation to participate but also you may know that the maker movement and maker spaces often end up looking like this a row of 3d printers which to my mind is not really all kinds of creativity for all kinds of people it's an interesting kind of creativity for a certain bunch of people but it's not for everyone other people want to be engaged in different kinds of ways with different ways of doing things at Creativity Everything, we like to think of everything as all parts of the same thing. So what you might refer to as theory and practice, or making and thinking, or doing and researching, they're all parts of the same thing. I've shown them here with a slash in between, but actually a plus sign works a bit better. Even better than that is the equal sign. So theory is practice, making is part of thinking, doing is researching. Here's what that looks like for Creativity Everything. We've got teaching and writing and collaborations and events and digital stuff and making things it's all parts of the same thing we've even snuck in transforming universities there quite a bold goal but say in may this year we did the creativity everything free school two weeks of creative everything open to everyone we invited anybody that wanted to come to participate in a range of different kinds of events about different approaches and techniques but whatever the actual thing was that you were meant to be doing the main thing was this invitation to think of yourself as a creative person, to step into this space where you see yourself as a creative being and to see what that feels like. So when we say all parts of the same thing, one illustration of that is that people will ask me what stuff we're working on and I'll say, well, I'm making this thing and I'm making that and we've got this project and I'm doing this teaching, all interesting stuff that I'm excited about. And then they'll say, and tell me about your research. And I will think, well, I just did. It's all of that stuff. It's all parts of the same thing. It's always about doing. It's always about bridging and including as many people as possible. And it's always about emphasizing the everythingness of everything. Thank you for listening and watching.